In this video, we will demonstrate how to set up the hardware components of the OtoSim. We recommend that you install the OtoSim software before setting up the hardware. Please refer to the video segment on software installation for more details. However, you will require the fully connected hardware before you can access the OtoSim software. Let's begin. Your OtoSim system consists of the following components. 1. An OtoSim base unit. 2. A USB cable. 3. An adult-sized earform. 4. An OtoSim USB software key. The USB key also contains a PDF of the OtoSim product manual. Please note that we no longer provide hard copies of product manuals. If you did not receive all of the items shown here, please contact us immediately. Note, an otoscope is not included in the OtoSim system, but is needed to use the OtoSim for training purposes. You can use any regular otoscope without the light. We do offer simulation-only otoscopes, which are sold separately. Also note, a computer is required to run the OtoSim, but is not provided. Please refer to the product manual to learn about system requirements for a suitable computer to run OtoSim. Hardware Component Assembly Setup Upon opening the case for the first time, remove the base unit and place it on a flat surface with the rubber feet facing down. To attach the adult earform to the base unit, remove the retaining ring from the display unit by turning it counterclockwise. Place the earform into the cavity and secure it by tightening the retaining ring. Next, let's connect the display unit to the computer via the USB cable provided. Remember, there is no on-off switch for the display unit. When connected to a computer via the USB cable, the computer provides the electric power to the display unit. Because of this, it is recommended that your computer always be plugged into a power source when using OtoSim. To connect the USB cable to the display unit, turn the unit upside down to access the USB port at the back of the device. To prevent damage to the port by accidental pulling of the USB cable, first run a portion of the USB cable through the metal hook next to the USB port on the back of the display unit. Then, align the USB cable plug with the USB port on the back of the OtoSim display unit in proper orientation to prevent damage to the port. Use the remaining USB plug to connect the unit to a USB port on the computer. Once the display unit is connected via the USB cable to the computer, the OtoSim logos on either side of the display unit should become illuminated. You may notice a small clicking sound when you connect the unit to the computer. Also, you will notice a blink on the computer screen and perhaps a slight change in the screen resolution. These are normal and are good indicators that the computer has recognized the unit. You are now ready for the initial computer setup. You will only need to complete the computer setup once. 1. Once the unit is connected to the computer, access the display preferences of the computer. Location of the display preferences will slightly vary depending on the type and the operating system of the computer you are using. Please refer to the product manual for specific details for the computer you're using. 2. We are using a Windows 7 PC in this video. From the display preferences, please make sure that the small blue window, which represents the OtoSim display unit, is placed at the top right corner of the large window, which represents your computer. The top boundaries of both windows are horizontally aligned. Testing the OtoSim display unit. 1. Open the OtoSim software by double-clicking on the OtoSim icon from the computer desktop. 2. From the top left side, click on the Tools menu and select Configure OtoSim. Follow the prompts. 3. Once you click Test OtoSim Unit, please look into the unit with an otoscope. You should see a green-colored checkmark. This confirms that the unit is ready for use. If you do not see a green check mark, please refer to the product manual for the technical troubleshooting section. You can always contact us should you need further troubleshooting assistance. Attaching multiple units. If you're looking to use multiple OtoSim units simultaneously, it is important that you connect them to the computer one at a time to ensure proper configuration. 
Also, you can only connect two to three Otosim units per computer, depending on how many USB ports the computer has. To run more than three units, you will need an Otosim recommended multi-port USB hub. Once you are finished using your Otosim unit, simply close the software and unplug the unit from the computer. Storing Otosim We recommend that you store the Otosim in its protective case when it is not in use. To store away the Otosim unit, loosen the retaining ring, rotate the ear 90 degrees clockwise, and retighten the ring. Now, place the unit back in the Pelican case with the rubber feet touching the back wall of the case with the ear form facing up. This concludes the hardware setup component for Otosim. If you need technical assistance, all contact information is available on our website at www.otosim.com and one of our representatives will be happy to assist you.